ion batteries are known all over the world. While they're found in gadgets and machineries, both great and small, from smartphones to laptops to electric cars and buses, they have their limitations. Can solid-state batteries be the breakthrough needed in electric vehicles? But before we dive into all that stuff, here's a quick reminder to like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Also, remember to drop your comments below as they help us to serve you better. Lucid seems to remain silent on their battery technology, but they market their cars with a 500-mile range, which gives reason to believe they have solid-state batteries. Other manufacturers such as Volkswagen and Toyota have been open about their ongoing solid-state battery development. But why is everyone so hyped on this technology? And who is that mysterious manufacturer already releasing an EV with solid state? Limitations of Lithium Batteries Even though they are popular, lithium-ion batteries have the following drawback. Lithium-ion batteries require protection from being overcharged and overdischarged, as both extremes can cause performance issues. The current has to be maintained within safe limits, too. In addition, the surrounding temperature has to be within a rather strict range for optimal performance. The effort to mitigate against all these faults with sophisticated battery management systems can add significantly to the cost of the battery. In addition, lithium-ion batteries don't age well as they have a finite number of charge-discharge cycles. They lose range as the vehicle gets older. This affects the cost of ownership as the cost of a battery replacement is high. This degrading effect is observed even when the battery is not in use. Lithium-ion batteries are also expensive, being the most costly component in the vehicle. It is high enough that EV makers admit that cheaper batteries are the breakthrough needed for EVs to be accessible to more people. Adding to the cost is the logistic challenge that transporting lithium-ion batteries is. Due to the safety hazard they can pose, the transportation in larger quantities is subject to regulatory control, adding to the total cost. Solid-state batteries, are they the savior? Research has been ongoing on how to make the EV batteries better. This has given rise to solid-state batteries. They differ from lithium-ion batteries in the aspect of the electrolyte, a key component. In solid-state batteries, the electrolyte is solid rather than liquid. In many other aspects, the two types of battery work similarly. The change in the physical state of the electrolyte comes with some key advantages. The most important benefit is the reduction in size, as the electrolyte is smaller than in the solid state. The most important benefit is the reduction in size, as the electrolyte is smaller when in the solid state, giving rise to a higher energy density. In simpler terms, more energy can be packed into the same size of lithium-ion battery. This opens up two possibilities to the car maker. Reduce the total weight of the car by using a smaller battery pack and still retain the range compared to lithium-ion batteries, or increase the range of the car without increasing the total weight. Heavy-duty vehicles like electric public buses can carry more electric energy, extending their range. Other applications where weight is a serious consideration, like electric aircraft, will also benefit from solid-state batteries. Despite having higher energy densities, solid-state batteries charge and discharge faster and more efficiently, meaning they perform better under colder conditions, an area where lithium-ion batteries are lacking. Solid-state batteries are also safer than lithium-ion. Unlike the latter, the former does not have any inflammable liquid electrolyte that may cause fire when internal exothermic reactions cause a buildup of heat that can make the battery expand or explode. This means solid-state batteries can be easily transported in large quantities. The elimination of internally generated heat results in cost and weight gains as there is no need to include cooling components or design advanced battery management systems. This is crucial in electric high-performance cars where heat is a serious consideration. Bentley, for instance, recognizes that solid-state batteries are a crucial ingredient if they would transition to an electric product lineup. Solid-state batteries also have the advantage of being able to withstand more charging-discharging cycles than lithium-ion batteries. The liquid electrolyte in lithium-ion batteries slowly corrodes the electrodes, making them less efficient and hindering battery performance over time. The solid electrolyte does not have such an effect on the electrode 
and the battery can last about five times as long as its lithium-ion counterpart. Challenges of Solid-State Batteries With all the aforementioned advantages, solid-state batteries are not being used by EV makers yet. This is due to two major challenges of the batteries. First off, solid-state batteries are very difficult to produce at the scale EV makers need. They are very expensive to justify commercial uses as the EV market is a cost-sensitive one. The only viable use cases would be high-end, high-performance applications where the cost of the battery is not an impediment. Second, researchers are still looking for the right atomic and chemical composition for the best solid electrolyte that will produce the right amount of ionic conductivity to make them powerful and reliable enough for driving EV motors. To illustrate, some car makers that plan to release electric models powered by solid-state batteries have had to revise their plans. Fisker Incorporation had announced such a car for 2020, but eventually shown off the Ocean SUV, powered by a lithium-ion battery, and kept quiet about their solid-state battery program. Clearly, more work still needs to be done on solid-state batteries for them to move from the lab to vehicle assembly lines. That notwithstanding, the EV industry as a whole recognizes the importance of solid-state batteries for the future of e-mobility. This informs the decision of global powerhouses like Toyota, Honda and Nissan to form a consortium to develop solid-state batteries, with enough work done already for a target of revealing a car powered by a solid-state battery at the postponed Tokyo Olympics. Other vehicle makers working on solid-state batteries include Daimler, which is teaming up with IBM to look for new angles in the technology using quantum computing. According to Katie Pizzolatto, Director of Applications Research at IBM, we need to find a fundamentally different chemistry to create the batteries of the future. Quantum computing could let us effectively peer inside the battery's chemical reactions to better understand the materials and reactions that will give the world those better batteries. There is also Dyson, the popular vacuum maker that abandoned their plans to make an electric car. They are, however, continuing work on solid-state battery tech. How long before solid-state batteries become a viable replacement for lithium-ion batteries depends on who is making the prediction. Volkswagen, for instance, is working with QuantumScape on solid-state batteries and expects them to be ready for car use by 2025. For Panasonic, however, solid-state batteries are still about tens away from mass production. This, though, is a company that has lots of investments in lithium-ion battery production. It co-owns Tesla's Gigafactory and makes the batteries used in Tesla cars. Panasonic's partner is even focusing on making lithium-ion batteries more efficient instead of researching solid-state batteries. Tesla's tablet batteries still use lithium-ion chemistry. It is telling that CEO Elon Musk, who is personally invested in producing a cheap EV with long enough range, is not considering solid-state batteries as one of the options. The Extrema Fulminea Many manufacturers have claimed to deliver the first solid-state battery EV to the market. Each manufacturer has been around in the media, and much has been said about each of them in regards to their solid-state battery, their technology and developments. But suddenly, a relatively unknown Italian car manufacturer shows up and claims to be the first to release an all-electric hypercar called the Extreme Fulminea. The Fulminea will be the first product of the Automobili Estrema, a new company established by Gianfranco Pizzuto, a former shareholder and distributor of Fisker in Europe and based in Modena, Italy. Estrema claims that the Fulminea will be the first street-legal hypercar to be fitted with a hybrid battery pack that combines solid-state cells with ultra-capacitors. The result, according to the company, is a 100 kilowatt hour battery pack with an unprecedented energy density of 450 watt hours per kilogram. For comparison, the Tesla Model 3s packed with the 2170 cells offer an energy density of around 260 watt hour per kilogram. Estrema also expects the batteries in the Fulminea to weigh under 300 kilograms or 661 pounds with the whole vehicle offering a curb weight of just 1,507 kilos or 3,307 pounds. The four electric motors give the car a peak power of 2,040 horsepower, which allows the car to accelerate from 0 to 200 miles per hour in less than 10 seconds 
with an estimated range of 323 miles. The car's price point is set at $2 million, and the first examples are planned to reach customers in the second half of 2023. Wrap up. At this point, nobody knows if solid-state batteries are ready to go commercial and be available for EVs. Solid-state batteries have clear advantages over lithium-ion batteries. They're safer, take up less space and weight, have higher energy and power densities, and withstand more charging and discharging cycles. Their use in electric vehicles are, however, held back by high production costs and the need for more research and development. As such, we may wait a while before seeing them in cars, with the latest estimates putting them at 2025. That's what we have for you on solid-state batteries, but we would love to hear what you think. Will solid-state batteries change EVs completely? Is it an unrealistic dream? Feel free to make use of our comments section below and see you in the next video.